But what you want me to send me? I'm Miss Kim De La Creme, and this is my sister. Hi, Kimberly Summers. And this is Thirsty Thursday, the video portion of Just Eat. joining us on this edition of Thirsty Thursday, where each week we bring you one cocktail recipe and a little finger food to go along with it. Nathaniel's out of town and my sister is in town, so I decided it's time for a girls' night. And what's better for a girls' night than booze? Alcohol it's... is like the best thing. Yes, it is. You know what the second best thing is? Cheesecake. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. I love cheesecake, and I know you do too. Fatty over here. Ooh, yes. Yes. Eating for two, but there's only one. What? Oh, uh, say, did Zach tell you something that I don't know about? Not yet. Oh well, it'll come okay. soon. So, back to this. We are making a cocktail, and it's not just any cocktail. It's called the Pink Squirrel. You heard me correct. Pink Squirrel. How we got the name, I really don't know. But all it is is creme de cacao and then creme de noyau. Creme de noyau is actually an almond liqueur that's actually made from apricots, just like amaretto. So we're gonna put all of that into a mixer with a little bit of ice cream and that's a big squirrel. So, ooh, I'm all prepared to make this cocktail now. I'm gonna add in the liquor and Kimberly, if you will, Scoop me some ice cream while I do that. Alright. Alright. We're gonna take the blender. Oop, another short cord. I can't pull it much closer to me. We're first gonna take our creme de cacao, which smell it. Ooh, smells heavenly. We're just gonna pour about an ounce and a half of creme de cacao. And we're gonna I said scoop me some ice cream, not eat the ice cream. I'm hungry. I'm sorry. It is not the weekend. You cannot eat yet. We only eat on the weekends, Kimberly. Family values. Some people have them. Some people don't. Now we're going to take our creme de noyau and about one and a half ounces again. Now, are you actually going to share that ice cream? Fine. We're going to add four scoops of ice cream into here. We lost our ice cream scoop in the in the move. I think it was the movers. The sticky fingers. Awful. Absolutely awful. And when this all combines, it's going to make this beautiful pink cocktail, which is why it's called a pink squirrel. Why it's a squirrel? I'm not exactly sure yet. Maybe it's the nuts. Everybody loves nuts. Especially you. <laughs> Alright. Now if we could get you to stop eating ice cream, I'm going to mix this. We're just going to pulse it a few times until it's completely combined. I don't know how this is going to 
taste. It's gonna taste heavenly. Just go me some more ice cream. Don't try this at home, folks. Try this at home, folks. I'm sure it's delicious. Let's go me some ice cream. What did I tell you? <laughs> I said school me some ice cream, not give me the entire carton. You can tell some people have never been in the kitchen before. I don't cook. That's why I let Zach cook. I'm an awful mom. Zach is her husband, if you don't know him. Here in Murfreesboro, it's a local bar. 
And they had a pony of pink squirrels, purple squirrels, brown squirrels, rainbow squirrels, rainbow squirrels. Ooh, it was absolutely wonderful. Now we're back to this cheesecake. We already combined our cream cheese and our raspberries. And now it's time to add in our sugar. Everybody loves our sugar. Let me get in here and get a scoop. Sugar. And now we're just going to mix this up too. Ooh, you hold my bowl. Thank you, sister. It's time for our white chocolate. I think it's over here on our double broiler, and I think it's already melted. I think so too. Look at it. Oh, it's just about there. While I'm going over there to get this, let me introduce Lint Excellence Chocolate. Lint, it's absolutely delicious, and I am now a representative for the RSV, RSVP program for Lint, which is like Pampered Chef, or for you perverts, Pure Romance. You can host a party and I'll provide all kinds of chocolate and booze. So, you just hit me up at my email, kim at chefjoshuaallen.com, and I'll hook you up. Now let's get this chocolate. Woo! Our chocolate is just perfect. Look how well that's melted. We're just going to scoop it down into our bowl. And it's going to be absolutely delicious. I'm so excited. I need a drink. Can I get my drink, please? Really? Really. Keep going. Keep going. Keep going. I'm refreshed. And I hate you. I love you too. Okay. I've added all this chocolate down here. Now we're just going to mix it up. Will you mix it up for me while I'm mm -hmm. putting this in the... Wherever this is going. I'm sure you're going to do it well. I don't make anything except like cereal and stuff that can go in the microwave. That's why I have you and live near you. That's true. The good thing about living in our new apartment, my sister is actually my neighbor. She lives right next to me. So now we have all kinds of parties and, oh, Nathaniel and, what's your husband's name again? I've had too many cocktails. Zach! <laughs> That's what it is. We get together and have little boys nights, we have our girl nights, like now. Maybe we can have like a family friends night, sister Ooh, night. Oh, that'd be so next much week. fun. We'll make it a we'll make it an episode. Yes. yes. Okay. Alright, it is all mixed up. Now it's time to put it in our baking pans and then stick some of our Sugar. Graham cracker crumbs. Oh. It's graham crackers. I it's not sugar. sugar. There's sugar in there. You are being punished for eating all my ice cream. Do not drink my drink. <laughs> don't drink my drink. Well, don't steal my weave. I didn't steal your weave. You snatched mine off and ran off with it. Finish. I'm hungry. All right. We got our graham cracker crumbs here. I combined with a little bit of butter and brown sugar. And we're going to put it in our regular pants now. So give me just a second. Let me find that. We're going to use some silicone molds. And you can just use whatever shape you want. Let me move this out of the way. I'm going to use these squares. I need a spoon. Did you use all my spoons in your ice cream? No. There you go. That is a dirty spoon. <laughs> it's in your house. Ew. It had ice cream all over it. It was not ice cream. It was some black stuff. Racist. Alright. Sorry to say. Who <laughs> thinks Mexican? Racist. <laughs> Nerve of some people. Alright, so first we're going to put our cream cheese mixture down in the mold. And we're going to fill it up almost all the way. Make 
sure you move it around to get out those air bubbles. Because once it goes in the fridge and it sets up, well, you're just screwed. So. All right, we got it just about filled up. Now we're going to add in our graham cracker crumbs. You're just going to put it on top and press it down. You can move all the extras on the sides into there. And that's it. So now you just stick this in the fridge, wait for about two hours, and it'll fully set up. Just pop it out of the silicone mold. You can put it in the freezer to make it come out even better. And that's it. So let me go pull it this. But wait, what if you don't have one of these? If you don't have one of these, well, then you can use anything. You can put it in a regular uh, spring form pan. You can put it in any other form of silicone mold and just pop it out. Whatever you want to do. It's like a muffin pan, because like, that's all I have in my house. Yes, a muffin pan. Okay, cool. A muffin pan is perfect. Just make sure you freeze it before you pop it out. Okay. It's perfect. So I'm going to stick this in our freezer, and I'm going to pull out our others, and hopefully make me another cocktail, because I am empty. No. <coughs> Ooh! I went down the wrong pipe. Now I'm empty. So we're going to go do that. We'll be right back. Ooh. All right. I pulled our cheesecakes out of the mold. Now it's a different shape because these were already frozen. And now it is time to eat them. Are you ready for this? Bigger part. Of course. She's always ready to eat. Here's your fork. You use it to eat with. And stab you with. Sure. If that's what she wants. I would love to see you try. Don't tempt me. Cheesecake. Mmm. That's good. Mmm. Cool. <laughs> the white chocolate net. Mmm. It's phenomenal. It complements the cream cheese and the raspberries perfectly. It's really creamy too. Oh, and that's because of the white chocolate. That's all that. Cocoa butter and the fat from the chocolate. Oh, delicious. So, thank you so much for joining us on this episode. If you want to host a lunch party, just give me a shout at kim at chefjoshuallen.com. And until next time, stay thirsty, my friends. And don't eat my ice cream.